Hello everyone. Welcome to Crochet All. Today in this video, I am going to share you some tips about crochet sofa blanket. So let's get started. Number 1. Choose the right yarn. Select a yarn that is soft, durable and easy to care for as it will be in frequent use. Acrylic or acrylic brilliant yarns to often good choice for blankets because they are machine washable and come in a wide range to colors. Number 2. Select the right hook size. The size of your crochet hook will accurate the density of drip on your blanket. Choose a hook size that complements the weight for your yarn and proceeds a fabric that, that is neither too right nor too loose. You can find hook size recommendation on the yarn level or the crochet patterns. Number 3. Use a switch pattern. Decide on a Swiss pattern that you like for your blanket. Popular choices for blankets include simple sticks like single crochet, half double crochet or double crochet. As well as more intricate Swiss pattern like says, granny squares or curve Number 4. Ghost Swatch Crochet a gauze swatch using for your chosen yarn and hook size to ensure the your finished blanket will be the size you want. Adjust for hook size if necessary to achieve your crochet gauze. Number 5. Plan the size. Determine the dimension of your blanket based on the size of your sofa and how you plan to use it. A standard size for a sofa blanket is approximately 50 to 60 inch wide by 60 to 70 inch long. But you can adjust the size to fit your needs. Number 6. Consider color and design. Think about the color shame and design elements you want to incorporate into your blanket. You can choose a single color for a classic look or use multiple colors to create strips or other patterns. Number 7. Joining yarn. When changing colors or adding new skins of your yarn, weave in the ends seriously to prevent them from coming loose. You can do this by crocheting over the ends as you work or by waving them in with the yarn needs when you finished. Number 8. Blocking. Blocking your blanket can help ever out stitches and give it a more polished look. Follow the blocking. Inclusion for your yarn type, whether it's wet blocking, 